So we shot this film here in the UK. We did. What British things did you introduce your American co-stars to? Whoa, what British things? I tried really hard to introduce them to a lot. Alden and I went to the theatre a lot. Because mm -hmm. he's a really big theatre buff and I like it as well. So I'd always book two tickets or something. I always do, I always book two tickets and you're like, whoever wants to come along. And I, so I end up always asking him first because I was always with him working on set all the time. <laughs> That's one thing that I did for sure. And then just slang. Slang? To teach some... What will translate for them? No, not much. It was interesting. It was sort of a one-sided conversation there. I reckon you can get... Anything between Cockney rhyming and just a bit of kind of like rude... Yep. Boy, rude mm. girl. I want to know, you're in all these great things, what junk food TV, like daytime TV, do you watch? There's two genres mm -hmm. that you'll find me in <laughs> if I'm like... Because a lot of the time, you're filming such intense stuff yeah. and you're literally like, I can't get involved in a really beautiful movie or in a really great TV series that's going to, like, haunt yeah. my dreams. So, you know, Grand Designs, <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with it. MasterChef, hello. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, lovely. You know what I sneak in after a stressful day is a bit of Hell's Kitchen. I can't handle that. It's oh, yeah. too much shouting. Oh, is it too much? It's too much. At least with MasterChef, oh. it's chill. Mm. Do you know what I mean? And it's very impressive. I do love, I'm a foodie, I love cooking. Mm -hmm. And Grand Designs as well is just chill. Also, Kirsty on location, location, location. <laughs> I think it's been very clear. <laughs> I do watch daytime television. <laughs> Every once in a while you're like, I need to turn my brain off. I'm just yep. going to see what the property is doing in London at the moment. For me, it's <laughs> Escape to the Country. That's Ooh, something I've not spent very much time in, but I sense I'd like. Trust me. Alist okay. Alistair Appleton is the host you want. Oh, yeah, and he absolutely. Ch chills you out. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. I know everyone's been asking you this, but I'm going to ask you anyway. Okay. What mementos have you got to keep from Solo? Well, I was given something really great. <laughs> I'm nervous now. Huh? No, 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 I know. There was uh, there was a piece of jewellery that I was given. It was pretty oh, very amazing. very nice. Yeah, very nice. I was very, very happy with that. And I like the idea that you wear it. No one has any idea it's what to do with Star Wars. No. And they, and they just go, nice. That's nice. Yeah. It's worth a million quid. Yeah. Um, what do fans typically say to you in the street when they spot you? Call easy. <laughs> Oi, you, aren't you famous? Oi, you. So yeah. polite. Give us a selfie. It's an often heckle that I get. Give For us. For future reference, please may I? Doesn't hurt. Would it be okay? Would it be if... alright if I? Yeah. Hello, Miss Clark. How are you today? Please, could I have a picture? Miss Clark <laughs> is a nice touch. <laughs> no, that does happen That's every good. once in a while. You're like, absolutely, you can. Incredibly polite. Has my teacher just asked me for a. <laughs> I know, selfie? yeah. Miss Clark, yes, what have I done? Do you get people coming up with the phone already? Like, yeah. like cocked already? They're like. Yeah. So sometimes you get people coming up and you're like, oh, you're just going to ask an autograph. That's really lovely. Because mm. this is the thing when people ask me for autographs, Nine times out of ten, I'm writing some kind of a yes. personalised note because I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. And with the selfies, when they're like, hello, <laughs> and you're kind of, sometimes, every once in a while, you're not having a good day and you're like, yeah. I don't think you want this picture, but I promise you I'll sign something for you if you'd like. If somebody asked me for a photograph whilst, for example, I was on a tube journey, no, yeah. no, the face it's, is just all wrong. No, definitely. Also, you're like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um... <laughs> We're gonna stay here. I, <laughs> it's, it's commuter time. Have you got gonna... motion blur? Yeah, exactly. On this, cool. Can you not? Get... <laughs> Can you not focus? <sighs> Tough Stuck one. here. Piccadilly Circus. This is my stop. This is Believe it, it or yeah. not, this is my yeah, stop. Yeah, it wasn't before. It is now. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. For more, check out my BBC iPlayer show, Movies with Ali Plum, and don't forget to listen to me on Greg James's show on BBC Radio One every Thursday at about quarter past six where you can hear the very latest movie reviews from yours truly.